dolls are better, classic beautiful Barbies or terribly gorgeous Monster High? Our awesome doll life hacks will help make your dolls unique. And who will win this doll challenge? Find out in our new video! Dolly and Christy love playing with dolls, and they can't figure out which doll is better, a Barbie or a Monster High doll. The girls need a professional judge. Miss Gonzalez doesn't know a lot about fashion. Fairy can only help with magic, but great fairy tale couturier Edna is exactly who we need. The friends interrupt each other bragging about their fashionable dolls. Be quiet! In order to decide which toy is better, Edna will arrange a doll beauty contest. For starters, we need to make a runway. Excellent! The doll fashion battle starts now! First, Edna gives them a task to come up with doll hair accessories. Christy makes a stylish headband for her doll. It's just like the one she has! Put a suitable hair tie on your doll's head so that it has a bow in the front. Now this Monster High doll stands out from the crowd with her bright accessory. You will certainly notice it on a shelf. And Dolly loves rings! Wow! Here's an idea for her doll! Take an adjustable ring and make it wider. Insert it into the Barbie's hairdo like it's a tiara. Make a necklace out of another ring. Barbie dolls turned into real princesses with regular rings. Now that's what we call a royal runway show! Edna is happy with the result, so she gives each girl one point. It's a tie in this round. The score is one to one. Now the girls need to give their dolls new outfits and come up with dresses that match their accessories. Fold a rectangular piece of fabric twice. Cut off a corner for a neck. Unfold the fabric once and make cuts for a belt. Stick a leather braid into the holes. Put the dress onto your doll and tie the belt. Decorate it with a glittering heart. The girls arrange a fashion show for their dolls. Tender Barbie looks wonderful in this beige dress. The dress on the Monster High doll looks great too. Fold a round piece of fabric twice. Cut off a corner for a neck. Make one more cut near it. Unfold the fabric once. Cut out the neckline. Put the dress onto your doll. Stick her hands into the holes. Tie a belt made from a string of sequins. This sky blue dress looks amazing with the doll's skin tone. Both dresses are marvelous! Barbie looks like an Amazonian queen and the Monster High doll is like a delicate damsel. But the dress on the Monster High doll is more appropriate for the contest, so Edna gives her one point. The score is Monster High 2, Barbie 1. Edna is inspired by the fashion show. Now she wants a party and a carnival. The girls feel her vibe, and they make festive accessories for the contest. Cut a plastic protective ring off a jar cap. Hot glue rhinestones to it. Dolly puts a shining crown onto Barbie's head. And Christy emphasizes her mysterious doll with a masquerade mask. Cover a doll's head with plastic wrap. Put a thin layer of cotton onto her face. Apply a little white glue and let it soak. Sprinkle the cotton with glitter. Remove it when the glue is dry and cut out a mask. Hot glue elastic ribbons to the sides. Both dolls are ready for a masked ball. Which look will win? The queen of the night, Edna, can't make up her mind who the winner is for a long time. And she has a change of heart a few times. But at the end of the day, Barbie's crown gets one point. It shines so brightly. The score is tied two to two. Edna checks how smart the designers are and gives them regular supplies to work with. Dolly gets light clay and Christy gets wire and sequins. What will they pull off? Cut a plastic protective ring off a jar cap. 
We will need two pieces. Attach ears made from light clay. Attach a piece of thin wire to the other piece. Roll the end to make it look like a cattail. Cover the wire with light clay and let it dry. Coat the pieces with acrylic paint. Put the headband and the belt onto your doll. The dolls support their favorite designer. Barbie's look is a pink cat with a long tail. And the Monster High doll flies in looking like a butterfly. Fold paper in half and draw a template of a butterfly wing on it. Cut it out. Twist a piece of thin wire following the silhouette. Fasten it in the center. Put the wings on one half of a piece of tulle and cover them with the other half. Hot glue it tracing the wire. Hot glue a string of sequins to the other side. Cut off the excess tulle. Decorate the wings with rhinestones and attach pieces of string ribbon to make loops. Put the wings onto a doll. The girls are proud of their masquerade costumes, but Edna pronounces her verdict. Cat Barbie wins! The score is 3 to 2 and Barbie is in the lead. While Dolly is busy creating another Barbie accessory, Christy takes advantage of this opportunity. She shows her invention to Edna. It's a toy suitcase. Make two holes in a plastic soap dish using a hot glue gun. Cut two pieces off a cocktail straw and hot glue them in the holes. Insert two thinner straws into them. For the handle, attach a piece of a chupa chup stick. Make four holes on the opposite side. Hot glue old toy car wheels into them. Attach a strip of a soft foam sheet to the side. Cover the inside surface with the soft foam sheet. Your Monster High doll is ready to travel. Every lady dreams about a suitcase like this. All her toy things will fit in it. She can hit the road. But Dolly managed to hop onto this leaving train. She presents an elegant Barbie handbag. Cut an empty matchbox. Hot glue the inside and the outside blocks together. Cover the box with faux leather. Attach leather braids as handles. Decorate the top of the bag. A handbag is an essential part of a basic Barbie wardrobe. But Edna thinks that the suitcase on wheels with a moving handle is way more practical. Monster High wins! The score is tied again at 3-3. Three three. Edna prepared surprises for the girls. Guess which hand? The girls get hats from the new collection of the Couturier. Coil knitting yarn to cover a sink strainer. Fasten it with hot glue. Barbie's hat is in the shades of blue, and the Monster High doll gets a broad-brimmed sparkling hat. Cut a circle from thick felt. Cut a round hole inside. Attach a suitable bottle cap. Coil twine to cover the cap. Fasten it with hot glue. Cover the brim of the hat with a string of sequins. The girls love these fashionable presents, and the dolls love them even more. Edna prepared an educational lecture on hairstyles. She will reveal the secret of styling shaggy doll hair. Rinse Barbie's hair in hot water. Use a silicone pot holder so as not to burn your hand. Apply hair conditioner and brush the hair. Blow dry the hair following the hairline. With this life hack, Barbie will always look like she just left a beauty salon. Dolly listened so attentively that she didn't notice when she broke her model's neck. That's alright! Edna knows how to bring Barbie back to life. Take the anchor from the doll's neck and insert a chupa chup stick into it. Cut it so that it slightly sticks out and insert it into the broken neck. Fasten it with hot glue 
and attach the head. Barbie doll got her head back. She looks way better like this. It's time for the final test. Edna brings out a box with old supplies. You need to use them to create a piece of doll interior decor that deserves to be the winner of this contest. Dolly finds a box of cereal. Hot glue an empty cereal box. Cut out two doors in the front side. Fasten them with painter's tape and attach pieces of tape along the doors. Cover the box with acrylic paint. Remove the tape and paint the doors white. Apply a layer of pink acrylic paint on top. Hot glue a string of sequins around the perimeter. Attach plastic beads instead of handles. Hot glue a skewer for hangers inside. A Barbie wardrobe is all done. All of her doll stuff fits inside. But Christy is sure that she will create something better. She just needs some fabric. Fold a rectangular piece of fabric in half inside out and fasten it. Turn the case right side out and stuff it with bean bag filling. Hot glue the hole and shape a bean bag. Christy made an amazing bean bag for dolls. She would totally win at an international interior design exhibition. And she also wins our contest. The battle is over and Monster High wins. The score is 4 to 3. Did you like our doll challenge? Then write in the comments which dolls you like more. Barbie or Monster High? And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel and click the bell so that you don't miss new challenges on Troom Troom.